In the start of this chapter, we see that Sung Yoon is fighting with the Demon King. Demon King tries to stop him by saying that there is some kind of misunderstanding, but Sung Yoon is not listening to anything. Demon King gets attacked by Sung Yoon attack. He thinks, I might actually die. I need to retreat. Demon King is trying to run away from there. Sung Yoon chased him saying, where are you going? He suddenly noticed something. We see that Zerpa is still alive and is trying to stop Sung Yoon. Zerpa says, please die graciously. If you stay alive, this world will fall to ruin. So many arrows are coming towards Sung Yoon. Daisy is attacking him saying, Neil, you're a hero. Think more rationally. Sung Yoon easily freed himself and stopped all the arrows. Alan tries to attack him from behind. He says, selfish bastard, if you survive, the fact that we all will die stays the same. Sung Yoon activates the skill, fighting concentration, and easily dodges the attack. Sung Yoon says, while you can't make the sacrifice yourself, you have the goal to try and sacrifice someone else. You all aren't even worth facing. Sung Yoon sees that the Demon King is going far away. He activates the instantaneous step. Demon King is happy because he thinks that he survived. Sung Yoon appears right behind him and grab him from his head. Demon King is very scared. Sung Yoon cuts his head. Someone is watching them. That someone is real Neil. He says, this is you choice? At the time, although I had a fatal wound, I ultimately ran away. And the world fell to ruin. And when I received the call of the tower, I climbed the tower as if I was running away. The days of my past where I climbed the tower with no place to return to. Yes, rather than those shameful days, this isn't a regretful choice. System says, Challenger Sunjian's choice has been confirmed. This decision has been confirmed as one that genuinely wouldn't be regretted. Congratulations. You have completed the 16th floor of the Tower of Trials. As a pass reward, you can infuse the absolutely impossible to destroy property to an item due to admin, fallen world soldier. We see Daisy and others. She says, just what is this? This is all wrong. The foundation of our life, the world. This world is ending. Administrator, fallen world soldier, is quietly watching those who were once his comrades. Sung Yoon is about to leave and says, you all don't even have the right to even die peacefully. I hope you die slowly and painfully along with this world. If there is anything after this, that is. System says, moving to the waiting room due to clearing a quest was slightly postponed. Administrator, fallen world soldier, is deciding the trial awards pay. Entering the Hall of Heroes. We see a big dragon statue. Sung Yoon is there. He thinks, is this like a temple for those who worship the dragon god? Someone says, not that way, this way. We see Neil is sitting there. Sung Yoon asks him, are you the fallen world soldier? He replies, yes, well, we've communicated several times by now. Sung Yoon says, it was more like you one-sidedly sent me messages. Neil says, that's the same thing. You're quite boring. Anyway, since you're here, ask what you're curious about. Sung Yoon asks him, why did you ask me to do that quest? You could have had your earnest wish carried out by a challenger you sponsored. Neil suddenly starts laughing. He says, I get who some of the gods find you interesting. Hey, don't misunderstand and think that all challengers are obsessed with climbing the tower like the monster you are. Most challengers don't have abilities as good as yours and don't have as strong of a will to climb the tower. No, even if they had the will to climb it, nothing would change. No matter how much you climb the tower, most administrators haven't seen the chances that they'll reach the end. Sung Yoon says, so rather than hoping you can change the past from the tower, you'll see the possibilities you couldn't see through quests like this, is what you mean? Neil replies, yeah, I want to deny it, but you're right. He clap and says, okay, let's settle our balances. System says, special authority, dragon god device set, has been designated challenger Sung Yoon as its user. Choose the item you would like to infuse the absolutely impossible to destroy property into. Decision complete. Engraving the absolutely impossible to destroy property into burrowing heaven sword a plus. Engraving the absolutely impossible to destroy property into true heavenly blood demonic sword a. True heavenly blood demonic swords infused soul ego's consciousness is slowly recovering. When true heavenly blood demonic sword infused soul ego's consciousness is recovered, time restriction will disappear. 
Neil says, most administrators wouldn't give crazy rewards like this, but I'm feeling nice in giving this to you, so you should be thankful. Sungyun says, we both got what we wanted, so why would I thank you? Neil says, you really aren't cute at all, and I'm really telling you this as a bonus, but never doubt the tower. Although we all failed to achieve our goals, you'll be different, Sungyun, because you are one of the few charming candidates that the tower is watching. System says, you have entered the 17th floor's waiting room. All restrictions on abilities have been released, and increases in abilities and obtained authorities will be corrected. Heir of the Dragon God. Rank S. An achievement you receive upon learning a Dragon God type skill. As an achievement award, you have obtained authority, dragonization. He thinks, the achievement I obtained from the 16th floor trial, Heir of the Dragon God. But, I thought the tower and the gods were kind of hostile. Why would the tower have created an achievement like this? If I think about it, the tower isn't blindly hostile towards all the gods, and there are even gods that the tower not only isn't hostile with, but goes as far as to create achievements for. And I am apparently a quite important candidate. Perhaps being chosen as a candidate by the tower means you become a deity. It's not a completely baseless guess. I've obtained divine power, faced the gods, and am actually going in the direction of development. Battle, rewards, development. It feels like the puzzle inside of my head is getting solved. Yes, the trials of the tower are the process to select the challengers as deities, and if you pass that process, you get designated as a candidate and are led to be able to develop into a deity. Well, this is just a hypothesis for now. I can guess the tower's exact intentions when I get stronger. Let's check out our newly obtained authority for now. Dragonization. His form is changing. It looks like he is turning into a dragon. He says, I really thought it couldn't be, but dragonization is really dragonization. This is the end of the video. Subscribe for the next part. How gloomy would this be? Demon says, the world will fail. There is enough causality for the demon god to descend. A world like this could easily be erased. Sungyun says, so what? Whether this world will falls or not, what does that have to do with me? Demon asks him, are you really not the hero? Sungyun replies, I kept saying it. Demon says, how is it that you are not even the apostle of the dragon god, yet you can use that authority? Then just who are you? He activates the skill punishment. While this skill is activated, all abilities will risen by seven. While this skill is activated, magic power will not be consumed. The dragon's power is filling you, making all magic power abilities rise by 100%. He tell him that he is a challenger. This is the end of the video. Subscribe for the next part.